But what if wife gonna go insult man, mama? Insult or beating or any of them? Any of them. You don't see another husband with that now. Yeah? You don't see another husband. I'm not going to turn that picture. Would you call the cops? Yeah. Yeah. So social media is buzzing. Women have come out to talk about men that hit their wives, domestic violence rally every day. But hey, men are not sleeping. Men have come out to talk about women that insult their mother-in-law and some women that hit their husbands. <laughs> Trust me. So I went out to know the reason that will prompt a man to hit a woman. If a woman can insult her husband, mama, maybe the man beat him. If that one warrant the man to beat him. If, if the woman go insult the husband, mama, you're not supposed to beat him now. Like, like, you're not supposed to beat her. You know, because of your mommy, come beat your wife. It's not good. Why you go be? Why you go cause my mama? Why they feed you? I they feed you every single mama bomb you. Now my mama bomb me very. He bomb me, train me. You can't come. You have the girls. If you not train me fine, I won't see you and me marry now. You know understand? And I'm doing well. If I'm not the person that is not capable enough to marry you, you won't say you will marry me now. So you don't have the right to cause my mother or to. Look out here or you just neglect my mother. You can't do that. It's so, unfair. So if the person does that? He's going to his papa's house now. Maybe they never carry house rent for where he did. Uh, you know, go, you know, go beat him. Uh -uh. With beating, huh? They will go to their family house. They'll come tell me because I pay in that area, I pay everything. So maybe they never carry house for your mama and your papa's house. They never take in one house where they give her. They never take her rent. That's how I go insult my mommy. I swear, I swear to God. Now, so it be now, Allah. <laughs> Hold on. You go beat her, you go show her lesson. Uh -uh. Very touch her beating. Beat him. If you do any way, uh -uh. you know, say, I go down and rob self. You go beat my mama. Man, no, me, if I do work, but then call me, man, no me to have a house now. Anything you want to do for my house, I don't beat my mama. If you hear, say me, me go beat in your mama, I ain't go feel. I delay the one feel. If you hear, say, I go beat in your mama. My mama could just die if I give her one slap. Those guys are not feeling that kind of thing. But I hate like beating woman. Ordinary argument. I said, you could just be the way with them feel. Those guys say beating. If you do like say, yeah, and I slap, you won't give her. If you go give her a blow, they go for. From Fenty, you go take it from that side, go down. I bet you won't. You should know the kind of a wife you, you have. And then you, you didn't just meet her that day, she insults your mother. She must have insulted some other people around you, which you endorsed. As a man, whatever thing you're not gonna take, as a man, you 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 stand your ground from the scratch. Whatever thing you won't want to see a woman do to people around you, you don't want to see her do it to some other people around. I mean, to people around you, even from the courtship before you even get into the marriage. So that's that's my opinion. It's true that husband and wife they are one flesh, and the Bible says a man will leave his father and his mother, and they will stick to their wife, and they will become one flesh. But at the same time. The mother of the, uh, of, of the husband that brought the child into the world is very important. Because the same Bible also mentioned in the book of Proverbs that children should obey their parents even, even though that the children should listen to the discipline of their father and do not forsake the law of their mother, according to Proverbs 23, 25. So, in, in, so if, if the man did not find the balance between the wife and the uh, mother, there will be crisis. That is why a man needs to be mature very, very much to be able to handle the emotion, emotion of the wife and that of the mother before he got into marriage. The Bible did not give a yastic as to age when a man will marry, a woman will marry, but it talks about that either man or woman should pass the bloom of youth. Passing the bloom of youth must be mature to be able to handle the emotional makeup of the mother-in-law and the wife because women are by emotion. It's very, very wrong for a man to beat a woman. So you understand, but on a good day, if I just come, I can't hear such. I can't hear such news. Say ah, my wife insults my mom. Fine, I go verify first. I go confirm what thing happened. I go hear from my mom. Then I go hear from my wife too. Then if I eventually find out, say yes, my wife insults my mom. I won't be happy with her. I feel bitter. That one no go do wrong. It's not wrong. It's not wrong for me to beat my wife that she insult my mom. It's not wrong. Now normal thing we say is supposed to happen. Because at the first place, why should go insult my mom? 
even if my mom do her anything, no matter what, you know, you know, lead to that, see, she could insult her. So you understand. So probably, if she, if if actually she do so, I get every right to beat her. It's not wrong. If my mother is wrong, I will question her. If she not she did wrong, I will question herself. So how is that supposed to? Or if she go insult your mama, I don't take her easy with time. Because she's not tell no tell me with time and knowledge. And if you insult my mama, she not come tell me say insult my mama. My mama can come and tell me say my wife insult her. Ah, uh, what I go do? She can't what I go do. If you know, if you know stay for the house again, I tell you, you can no take her. You beat her seriously. I no beat her. I will just send her. May you go rest in my place. May you go stay by mommy place first. For how long? I don't know. Till my mind come down. Why are you going insulting my mama? For waiting now. You're not supposed to insult your husband, mother at all. Not right at all. So if you're bitter, I dare. Go caution her. Where where? Me in touch her. Small. <laughs> small. Next time, no talk to the mama. Yeah. Husband, mama again. So me in touch the woman. Small. Small. Go talking to the husband. Uh -huh. Which one be small? We just one slap. At Eh? Which one be small? Which one be tortured and small? Small. Go sharp for him. Mm. Go holler for him. Where, where? Somebody say go beat him. Go holler for him. Sharp for him. At times, now they need beating. They are not do well. Welcome to Fossville Luxury Hotel. At Fossville Luxury Hotel, we offer excellent service. Our rooms have all the necessary facilities to make your stay comfortable and memorable. You will also have access to internet service, breakfast, 24 hour power supply, full air condition, free international calls, free time pumping service, and free car battery charge. So, what are you waiting for? Quickly visit Fossville Luxury Hotel. We are located as number one at Delhi Roba Michele off Raja Rasaki Road, First Estate, Amuo or the Fifth Stack League. For more information or reservation, please call. Call us on 080-75-78-7135 or 080-99-90-0601. You can also take advantage of our online ongoing promo at www.forcevhotel.com to make your reservation and payment for your favorite room, which attracts a discount rate. Please note, rooms are reserved based on first come, first serve. Forcevhotel, experience the home of comfort. They come, they come.